Hello, it's Mr. F Reaper here doing some conquest on battlefield for you. I'm doing a, I'm on Arika Harbor and the current setup I'm using is the F two thousand with the M one nine one one um pistol. A lot be I said that a lot easier now. And the red dot site with the um, grade launcher and the explosion thing. Okay. So in this um, video I've got the first half of me basically fucking around trying to do get a pin and on the second half it's for with the Neilstead 2000, the gun that I was previously wondering what it was like, how it, basically why that guy always got me from such a far distance, and now I know because I do some serious ownage with it in this video. Let's just say I get halfway through the match and I manage to get bronze before the match ends, which is quite good in my opinion. <laughs> so. I'm going to cover first a couple of things in the first half because this is just really me getting the five kills in a row pin. Okay, so after a previous um, rant about some of the pins, I managed to get the killing three people with a vehicle, the road kill one and the grenade launcher one and all that. So that's quite good. I'm now I am only one pin from getting the insignia of having all pins which is really good anyway so Medal of Honor this the release date still hasn't been confirmed which is really crappy because they said oh, it'll be sometime this week for it but they still haven't given us it and it's for it's almost Friday it's almost the next week after that so I'm not looking forward to that Sorry if I sound a bit blocked up or ill or something, I've still, I have hay fever, it's the summer time and I'm going to have it for the rest of the summer, so I'm really sorry about this guys. Okay, so this is the promised, fo promised footage of the, um, what's it called, oh aye, the Neilstead 2000 shotgun, which is a totally brutal shotgun to, in my opinion, it's my favourite shotgun in the game anyway. So, um. Pretty much, I don't really play Conquest that much, but I'm going for the 100 um, flag captures insignia, which, um, hang my jig, which requires you to play Conquest. So I've been I've been playing a lot of Conquest lately, and I'm only like 30 odd in to getting the the badge. So to be honest, still gonna I'm gonna hopefully have a lot more on Conquest instead of just been playing old Rush. And hopefully some onslaught for you as well. As I don't really see a point in playing Rush all the time. As it it, it it is quite boring to be honest. Um, do you guys agree with me? Do you hate seeing the same type of game, like game type, all the time? Get a leave. Put your comments in this comment bit below. Anyway, so we're closing on on no, not really half of the match, but I'm I'm going to get the Neilstead quite soon. I'm rank 22 now guys, I've got every weapon and I'm getting that bit closer to achieving all the bronze weapons. Um, you could probably check my battlefield stats out to have a look and see how I'm doing. And maybe you could give me some tips on how to get some of the um, insignias and pins etc. So, um, so at the moment I'm trying to get the 25 stars with this, the F2000, I do get it. So that's me finally unlocked the Neilstead um, shotgun. Now this is really good gameplay in my opinion. So I'm running about as the engineer with the M1911 with the Gustav and the two shotgun enhancements and pretty much alternate fire on my vehicle which isn't too, nah, isn't too helpful but this is just some ownage right here. Even though I fail a couple of times getting them, I managed to kill three guys, but due to reloading, I die here. Not I hate reloading because I always end up getting me killed. Um, me and Jaren were talking about that. Imagine in real life if you had um, suffered from reloading, you died because it. That'd be pretty gutting in my opinion. So. Um, I do some I lot some onage here. This is where the long distance came in. Handy. Fail a couple of times, but my aiming isn't terribly good at all. It's alright, but it's not terribly good as a lot of people will say. 
Well, not a lot of people, but people who comment. People I know. <laughs> um, so I'm looking forward to Odd Slot coming out. Um, that looks like a fun game mode, but see, be honest, I don't really have that much people on my Xbox friends left to actually play with, because it seems like a game where I'm going to need to have a medic, an engineer, a um, recon, and a... Um, assault class, it seems like a game, a game type that I'm going to need everybody for. So if anybody wants to join me when Onslaught comes out for the Xbox 360, send me a message with your um, gamer tag. Now I'd choose and when Onslaught comes out and you're all free, I will get you added and we'll get a game so I can put it up on YouTube. Hopefully as soon as possible so that I can get, them, you, you, uh, I can get the viewers the game type because I don't want a, a week later after it comes out to give it to you because that's just pretty boring. So I'm pretty much just bumping about with this shotgun now trying not to die and to be honest it's really effective I'm managing to kill a lot of people. I don't sadly it's not a streak that I get here I do die. I don't really know why I was bumping about in my selection to become a sniper there I don't know I the thing of going sniper, do you ever get that where really I think there's four classes because you have four mood, moods for the game. Do you really feel like being a range guy? Do you want to heal? Do you basically I think the four classes are so good because they come in handy with your actual mood be, mood because I've seen I've played the game and I've played every class. Now this is quite a good bit. I see this guy running, I was like, ah, so I thought, there's somebody there. I'll run out here, and there he is. Boom. Fucking dead. And then, get this guy. Simple, he's just not watching his back. He should watch his back because I'm there. And to be honest, if I'm there, you're dead. Just as simple as that, guys. So as I was saying, I always have a feel for what I want to play in this game. I don't ever go into the game thinking I'm going to be a medic or I want to go my engineering class. I kind of I just have a feel for it. I mean, this house cra crap is that of death. I hate dying in this game, it's so sucky. <laughs> Does anybody else agree with me in this? Um, so at the end of the video I got a good wee kind of point to prove at the end of this video so I'm looking forward to that. Sorry about that black screen, that was just an editing fault. But I get this guy. I think that was me changing the clip and I mustn't have edited it right. Sorry about that guys. But anyway, so we're closing to the end of the video. Now how good a shot was that from a distance? He was moving and everything. So I'm sorry if this hasn't been as exciting. Right, watch this. I noticed that guy. I didn't even notice that guy when I was playing this game. Right, and I was playing it properly. And I'm just like, hmm, there's some, there is something in here. I knew there was something in here. But I just go, fuck you mate and fuck you too and that's how you pawn the noobs guys so there's a good wee lesson for you but I like that I like the way I done that is I jumped down got one guy and then span around got the other I really like the way I done that okay so now it seems slow to me the video seems slow but that's just me anyway so and um, we're closing to the end of the match they're almost losing, we're almost winning, but I'm in the team we should win. There shouldn't have been a point to prove. I'm in this team, we have won. <laughs> I really wish it weren't like that. I really wish I was that lucky that whenever I was I was playing a game, I'd win. Because then I'd have a win-lose ratio of like, pff, I don't even know how much. But anyway, when I'm playing this game, I don't really notice a lot of things that are around me. <laughs> Sadly not, maybe not the best type of person to play a shooter. But look, there's a sniper guy right there and I don't even notice them. Maybe not the best um, thing to do when you're playing FPS not to notice things that are around you. But I managed to pawn this guy. Now here's a lesson. This is why you do not spawn with your squad mate as the recon squad mate because he's going to be so far away and it's good to be far away but here's why you don't now, I think there's that sniper guy up there. But, fucking die. That is how I roll. I just pawn them three in a row. Four if that guy never died. That's how I roll, guys, and that's the end of the commentary. So, they only got eight left, and 
that's um, pretty much us won. So there you go, 25 kills with the Neo said. So please rate, comment, subscribe. I um, hope you like my videos. Lewis is now going to be taking a much more com contribution to the channel. We're going to have vid video up regularly. We're going to have a Joe commentary up soon, guys. So I hope you all enjoy that. As soon as Medal of Honor comes out, anyway. So I guess I'm like a 32 KD, 32 to 9 KD, which is really good in my opinion. So here's some of the stats, so I hope you like the video, please rate, comment, subscribe, and I'll have more um, gameplay from Battlefield to use soon. So that's a 3.56 KD, and have fun guys, and I'll see you all later. Bye!